I'm Jack Hansen here at Lunatic Fringe and today I'm going to show you how to do a smoky eye. So with a smoky eye you always want to have a really nice precise defined brow. You can do that with using a eyeshadow or a pencil. You just want to make sure it looks nice and consistent on both brows before you get started. Smoky eyes always have a highlight under the brow so don't be afraid to use a nice shimmer in a really light color. You can do pinks, you can do whites or creams. So after you've done your highlight, you just want to choose two colors for the lid here. You don't want to go overboard and choose too many because it can start looking a little messy. So we're going to apply with a smaller brush our medium shade just right there on the lid. Just placing it in. Don't be afraid to get a lot of pigment on there because this is a really dark look. Smoky eyes are generally best for nighttime or special events. So we're placing that over the entire lid, then we're going to go back to our other eye and do the same thing. Make sure you have some kind of a concealer on your eye prior to, just so that the makeup sticks nice and well and is long lasting throughout the day or night. Now we're taking a nice dark black color with a little bit of sparkle in it and we're just going to place it right here on the crease and just kind of blend that in. If you want a really smoky eye you can do black all over the lid but if you're going to do that you might want to transfer to gray kind of in this area that way it kind of opens up the eye a bit. So we're just lightly tapping and placing Again, we're going to take our blending brush and go back and smooth, so don't worry if it looks a little bit angled or looks like it has a little bit too much lines in it. And also, whenever you're doing a smoky eye, you always want to do an eyeliner as well. So once you have enough pigment on there, then you can go back and take your blending brush, just smooth out those corners, just kind of blend that in. And whenever you're doing a smoky eye, you want to make sure that you do your concealer under your eye last, because you're always going to get a little bit of fallout. Again, I'm Jack Hansen, and I just showed you how to do a smoky eye. 